Hello, how to find all the roots of x power 3 plus x power of 2 is equal to 12. So first we take this 12 to the left side, then to be x power 3 plus x power 2 minus 12 is equal to 0. Then as in here we have two terms, so in this negative 12 we make into two terms which is negative 8 and negative 4. So it will be x power 3 plus x power of 2 then this is same as negative 8 minus 4 is equal to 0. Then it will be x power of 3 plus x square, then minus 8 is same as 2 power of 3, minus 4 is same as 2 power of 2 is equal to 0. Then in next step, it will be x power of 3, then this minus 2 power of 3 plus x square minus 2 square, is equal to 0. Then in next step, from this part, we'll apply a perfect cubic rule which is a power of 3 minus b power of 3 is equals to a minus b bracket bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket. So in here, it will be a minus b which is x minus 2 then bracket bracket a square is x square then plus a times b is x times 2 which is 2x then plus b square is 2 square which is 4 bracket then plus in this part we'll apply a perfect cube rule which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket then bracket a minus b so, as in this part is in this form, it will be a plus b is x plus 2, so bracket x plus 2 bracket, then bracket a minus b is x minus 2, then bracket is equal to 0. Then in next step, in here x minus 2 is common, so we take x minus 2 out of bracket, then this divided by this is this x square plus 2x plus 4 then plus this divided by this is this x plus 2 bracket is equal to 0. Then it will be x minus 2 bracket bracket x square then 2x plus x is 3x so to be plus 3x plus 4 plus 2 is 6 bracket is equal to 0. Then in here we have two solutions, whereas this is the first solution which is x minus 2 is equal to 0 and this is the second solution x square plus 3x plus 6 is equal to 0. Now to solve from here we take negative 2 to the right side it will be x is equal to 2. So this is the first value of x. And to solve from this quadratic equation, whereas a is equal to coefficient of x square is 1, b is equal to coefficient of x is 3, and c is equal to constant is 6. Then from quadratic formula, x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b is 3, then plus or minus square root of b square is 3 square, which is 9, minus 4, times a, a is 1, times c, c is 6, then over 2, times a is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative 3 plus or minus square root of 9, minus 4 times 6 is 24, then over which will be equal to negative 3 plus or minus square root of 9 minus 24 is negative 15 then over 2. Then it will be x is equal to negative 3 plus or minus square root of negative 15 is same as 15 times negative 1 then over 2. So it will be equal to negative 3, then plus or minus 
square root of 15 times square root of negative 1 is i, then over 2. So in here we have two solutions, whereas the first value of x, the first value of x is this real number, which is equal to 2, and the second value of x is equal to, when it's positive, it will be negative 3 plus square root of 15i over 2. And the third value of x is equal to, when it's negative, it will be negative 3 minus square root of 15i over 2. So these are complex solutions. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.